A CT scan takes a series of X-rays and uses a computer to put them together to create a detailed picture of the inside of your body. It helps your doctor find out the cause of symptoms, plan your treatment, or check your treatment is working. Most CT scans take around 5 to 20 minutes, but expect to be in the hospital for an hour or two. This allows time to prepare for the scan and any waiting time afterwards. Tell the hospital in advance if you have any allergies, are pregnant, or if you'll need an interpreter for your appointment. At the imaging department, you may fill out a checklist with the radiographer. They then explain what to expect. You need to remove any metal items from the area being scanned, such as jewellery or clothes with zips. They'll tell you if you need to change into a gown for the scan. Before or during your scan, you may need to drink some water or a type of dye called a contrast medium. This helps to make the pictures clearer. The radiographer may also put a small plastic tube called a cannula into your arm or back of your hand. This connects to a drip also containing the dye. As the drip goes in, you may get a metallic taste in your mouth, feel warm and you might think you are peeing, you're not. These feelings are normal and pass quickly. During the scan, the bed moves in and out of the scanner. It's not noisy. It sounds a bit like a washing machine. The radiographer controls the scan from a separate room. You can still talk to each other. They may ask you to hold your breath at times during the scan. You usually stay in the department for about half an hour after having the drip. This is to check you don't have a reaction to the dye. Your doctor usually gives you the results at your next appointment. For more information, visit cruk.org tests.